So when I want to do this and show you what this is good for, it's good for taking a big number and finding what, if you're only interested in what its remainder is divided by something, finding out what that remainder is. Uh, I'm going to show you a simple example and, and you'll see how to, to uh, you'll see enough to show the wheels turn. I'm going to take my se favorite number, 1729, and I'm going to show you what its remainder is when divided by 17 without actually dividing it by 17. Okay, so let's take this and I'm going to write it as 1 times 1,000 plus 2 plus 7 times 100 plus uh, 2 times 10 plus 9. Okay, well, first off here, let, let's kind of get our, our, our stuff organized that, uh, okay, seven, 9 mod 17 is just going to be 9. Okay, and okay, 10 mod 17 is anything. So this is 2, it's easier just to take the 2 times 10. This is 20, 20 mod 17 is 3. Okay, now let's be smart. Okay, so 100 is equal to 5 times 20. Okay, when I take that mod 17, the, the 5 is still 5, but the 7, but the 20 we've just calculated is 3. So this is 15. Okay, so I take this 15, okay, that would be 100 times 7, but okay, uh, let's, let's again be smart. 7 times 15 is 7 times 3 times 5. Okay, uh, I want to take this mod 17, okay, uh, 7 times 3 is 21, which is equal to what? 4 mod 17, 4 times 5 is 20, which is again 3, so that I have 3 here, okay? Then I have, okay, 1,000, okay, so 1,000, okay, that is equal to uh, 100 times 10, okay, 100, right, we figured was equal to, mod 17 is equal to 15 times 10, okay, so uh, 15 times 10 is, oh, let's see, let's see, 3 times 5 times 5, 5 times 5 is 25, 25 mod 17 is, okay, 3 plus 5, which is 8, so this is 3 times 8, which is 24, 24 mod 17 is 3 times 4, which is 7. Hmm. I, I might want to check in a minute if I did that right. Let, let, let's, I'm going to pause the video and check if I did this right. Well, isn't this wonderful? I can't pause the video. Let me check my arithmetic. I, I, got, I worked it in class and got a different answer. Okay. So if I take 1,000 divided by 17... Okay, that's equal to 58. So I take seven, uh, 1,000 minus 17 times 58. 58 God. Okay, so 1,000 minus 17 times 58 is equal to 14. I knew I got it in a different in class. So... At some point, I, I, I had a, a brain fart in this calculation. So this should be 14. Okay, so now 
let me look at this. Uh, 14 plus 3 is 17. So I can, uh, seven, which is equal to 0 modulo 17. And so this is 12. Now, let me look, having done the work, let me do, look, do calculator and see if I check my answer to do it right. Because, God, yeah, I do make mistakes. Uh, 1729 divided by 17. Okay, so I would take 1729 minus 17 times 101. So 1729 minus 17 times 101 is equal to 12. And I'll be damned. It's the same one. Okay, so again, this is how it can be applied. If I, I, and I'm lousy at arithmetic. Okay, so figure out where I screwed up there and come to me after class and tell me.